Hello and welcome to IB Times TV. Today is Friday, September 9th. I'm Virgil Sebrian. The sky may not be falling, but a NASA satellite will be soon. A defunct satellite that has been deteriorating in orbit is expected to fall down to Earth later this month or early October. The Upper Atmosphere Research Satellite launched in 1991 from the famous Discovery Shuttle at the tune of $750 million. The 6.5-ton satellite ran out of fuel in 2005. Satellites in orbit naturally lose altitude once fuel is depleted. NASA says pieces of debris can land anywhere between Alaska and South America, but it is too soon to tell. Debris footprint is estimated at 500 miles. NASA expects most of the satellites to burn in Earth's atmosphere. Only 1,200 pounds is expected to survive. There is a 1 in 3,200 chance that a satellite part could hit someone. However, cause for alarm should be minimal. NASA has not reported any injuries from falling objects from space since its inception. NASA considers safety a top priority. The, na the satellite studied Earth's atmosphere in interactions with the sun. The study showed that human-produced CFCs had a hand in creating the hole in the ozone layer. If you find any debris from the satellite, NASA says to avoid touching it and to contact law enforcement for assistance. Virgil Sebrian, IB Times TV. <laughs> NASA says pieces of debris can land anywhere between Alaska and South America, but it is too soon to tell. So basically, us, United States. It could fall on us. I wish he would just say that. Because what's in between Alaska and South America? Yep. Surprise, surprise. A defunct satellite that has been deteriorating in orbit is expected to fall down to Earth later this month or early October. The brief footprint is estimated at 500 miles. NASA expects most of the satellites to burn in Earth's atmosphere. Only 1,200 pounds is expected to survive. There is a 1 in 3,200 chance that a satellite part could hit someone. A defunct satellite that has been deteriorating in orbit is expected to fall down to Earth later this month or early October.